It's travel time for the UConn women's basketball team. The Huskies head to San Antonio, where they are the number one seed in their region. Head coach Gino Oriema, though, did not make the trip after he tested positive for COVID-19. We brought that to you as breaking news yesterday. Channel 3's Mark Robbins has a look at who will replace Gino on the sidelines and how that might affect UConn in the first two rounds. Not good timing on this one, Mark. No, but what are you going to do? Gino's going to miss uh, at least the first two games that are scheduled for Sunday and Tuesday in uh, San Antonio, assuming the Huskies win game one. But there's no sense of panic in the program because associate head coach Chris Daly will guide this team, and she has shown all the experience and talent and then some of all the great coaches in women's basketball. In fact, Daly herself is a Hall of Famer, having been inducted into the Women's Basketball Hall of Fame in 2018. Daly's skills involve a lot more than just keeping Gino in line. She's the director of recruiting, so we know how she can bring in the best in the country. We have the utmost respect for CD um, and trust her and, you know, what, whatever she calls, you know, we, we have to get it done. Her and Coach have been coaching together since before the end of time. Well, let's not go that far, but it has been nearly forever. Daly came to UConn in 1985. Ten previous times throughout the years, Chris Daly has filled in for Gino as a game coach, and she's never lost. She's a great person and a great advocate and a great coach. Um, just just to be there, to be there in our corner with us, um, you know, as unfortunate as coach is not going to be there with us. So, um, like I said, nothing really changes. She's going to prepare us, and we're going to be ready, uh, just like coach was there. I have complete confidence and complete trust and faith in um you know, CD and Shay, Marissa, I mean, uh, Shay, C CD, and, um, and Jamel. Um, I'm, uh, you know, I'm, a, I'm an innocent bystander right now. Innocent? All right. <laughs> I checked in with UConn today to get an update of Gino. Uh, I was told that yesterday's press release is all the information the school's going to mention. I'm Mark Roberts. Back to you guys.